Hi there, I'm Vaidatas, and in this video I will walk you through the steps of creating a custom login page using the Login Press plugin. Let's get to it. If you're trying to create a membership website using the default WordPress toolkit, you'll get a generic WordPress login page. However, you can and should customize it to your preferences or branding purposes. Designing a custom login page will greatly benefit your site, improve user experience, and enhance your branding strategy. Moreover, you can add extra security features to help prevent cyber criminals from exploiting your site. There are multiple ways to customize a WordPress login page, including using a page builder or custom CSS. But the simplest method is using a custom login page plugin like LoginPress, Forminator, or Ultimate Member. In this video, I'll use LoginPress as it's one of the most popular WordPress login page customization plugins available. First, we'll need to activate the Login Press plugin. Log into your WordPress account, go to the plugins menu, and click Add New. Type Login Press in the search bar and click Install and then Activate. Now, navigate to the WordPress sidebar and choose Login Press. Then, click Customizer. You should see a similar welcome screen, but we'll skip this step for now. You will see the visual display of your login page on the right, while you can customize its content using these options on the left side. If you hover over each element, you'll see a pencil icon which you can click to tweak an element. You can unlock additional features by buying the premium version such as custom themes, reCAPTCHA, and Google Fonts. However, a good portion of customization options are available for free. So, first you can replace the default WordPress logo with your own brand image. You can also change its size, padding, URL, and position. To demonstrate, I'll change this picture to Hostinger's logo. Click Select Image, then drag and drop or simply upload the desired image. Don't forget to fill in the alt text and hit Change Image. In the background menu, you can use custom colors, choose a background image, or add a video file to enable an animated background. This time, I'll pick a custom color, so I shall turn off the background image by clicking this toggle. Keeping that login button blue like that feels a bit off, so I will change it using the same purple color as the background. Go to the button beauty menu, then change the color by clicking select color. You can also add more tweaks, like customizing your lost your password button and overall login forms appearance to make it slightly more engaging. Moreover, the plugin also lets you create welcome and multiple error messages for different scenarios. You can change the footer and button elements as well. Feel free to customize these elements to your liking, and if you have unique requirements, you can also add custom CSS and JavaScript elements if you're familiar with this stuff. Once done, don't forget to click Publish. For tweaking additional non-visual elements, navigate to the Login Press dashboard and click Settings. Here, you can enable other features, reset the plugin settings to default, and change the required login credentials. WordPress's default login page is rather vulnerable to cyber threats, as hackers often try to access accounts using brute force and DDoS attacks. Let's walk through the three ways you can add extra security layers to your WordPress login page to help protect your site. Two-factor authentication is an additional verification step required to access an account. It helps protect users' accounts when their passwords or usernames are compromised. This security feature typically sends a verification link to a connected device via text or email. Another method is to use an application like Google Authenticator to generate a random verification code. It is an important safety measure since hackers can easily guess or obtain login information through phishing attacks, a common WordPress security issue. To access a 2FA protected account, users must click the verification link, enter the code, and input their login credentials. I recommend enabling two-factor authentication even if your site doesn't collect sensitive information. It makes sites visitors feel more secure, improving trust in your website. To enable it on your WordPress website, use a plugin like Warfan Security, which lets users register their devices to your site. Here's how you can activate it. Once you have installed and activated the WordFence plugin, navigate to Login Security, then Two-Factor Authentication. Scan the QR code with an Authenticator app on your mobile device. Alternatively, you can type out the provided code on the page. Enter the number generated on your mobile app, then click the Activate button to complete the setup process. Cyber criminals may attempt to guess login credentials using bots. These programs generate possible username and password combinations until they find the right one. Bots will try thousands of combinations in a matter of seconds, which can result in a request spike. If your site can't handle these requests, it will slow down or become inaccessible. Enabling reCAPTCHA helps prevent bots from making such brute login attempts. 
It uses security tasks to verify if the login requests come from humans. I'm sure you have seen one while logging into a website. Since bots can't log in, they can't verify if the generated credentials are correct. It helps minimize logging requests, maintaining your website's performance and uptime. LoginPress provides this feature alongside with its premium package. WordPress doesn't limit the number of default login attempts users can make. This is the main reason why WordPress websites with the default login page are vulnerable to brute force attacks. Limiting the number of login attempts using a plugin helps reduce this risk. When hackers fail to log in, it temporarily locks the account and notifies the site administrator about a potential breach. Some custom WordPress login page plugins, including LoginPress, offer this feature as a premium add-on. Alternatively, you can enable it for free with the Limit Login Attempts Reloaded plugin. And that's how you can customize and secure your WordPress login page. Like and share this video if you found it helpful, and don't forget to subscribe to Hostinger Academy's YouTube channel for more videos about website development. As always, thank you for watching and good luck on your online journey.